In a county where housing options are scarce but demand is still high. We must continue to say yes to much more housing in the cities and towns of Chittenden County. City, state and housing leaders gave an update on their five-year plan to fix the problem in Chittenden County. These projects are critical for building a stronger, healthier future for Vermont. When it comes to building more general housing, officials are right on target with their goal of creating 3,500 new homes over five years. But they're still lagging in another important area. Right now, we are short on the affordable housing goal. 191 affordable houses were built at the end of last year. It should have been 280, 89 short of the two-year goal set by the Building Homes Coalition. The problem is not not enough funding. Affordable housing developers need um, public funds to make the cost of the housing affordable to the renters who we're renting to. Federal money, tax credits and bonds are just some of the resources needed to fund the projects. The Housing for All bond passed by the legislature last year is contributing to developments like Cambrian Rise, which is expected to add nearly 800 new housing units within six to eight years, 25 percent of them affordable. We need to do it again. We need to pass a second $35 million bond in 2019. Burlington Mayor Moreau Weinberger acknowledges Chittenden County has a long way to go. Solving the housing crisis is not a quick fix. Two good years don't overcome decades of underproduction, don't under overcome decades of too many proposals uh, failing to go through. In Burlington, Helena Batapaglia, NBC5 News.